Hi everyone, it's Carmelita Black with EXP Realty and we are here at EXPCon 2019 and if you are not here, you missed a treat. So you better take, stay tuned and check out the new announcements that are going on. And I am here to do a quick interview with Fee Gentry of EXP and we're going to ask three quick questions. So stay tuned to the very end. You're going to enjoy it. Be sure to like and share this video. Hi Fee, I'm so glad to see you. Good to see you. I'm so glad to see you. Person. Yes, 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 absolutely. Now, yeah. tell me, what attracted you to EXP Realty? Um, immediately, when Gene Frederick uh, showed me the business model, I got it. And not as a realtor, but more as a business model. Mm -hmm. And so, just, you know, I was looking, I was 49 years old when I joined EXP, and I'm like, what am I going to do with the rest of my life? I don't want to sell transactions. I needed, uh, I didn't have enough money saved. You know, I know I couldn't save $936,000. And so the business model just made sense. And then more than that was the culture and the leadership. Um, when I met Glenn a few months later and Jason Gesson, I knew that I had made the right decision for me personally and business and for business. That's awesome. Now my second question is, wasn't that awesome? That was awesome. Now my second question is, what is your preferred niche? Um, my preferred niche, and I'm probably unlike most realtors, I only sell new home construction. I have not oh, sold a okay. resale home in about six years. Most of my career has been, about 80% of my career has been um, new home construction. And then my second niche are women. Um, women are the second fastest growing demographic in the United States. And so um, I think that it's highly important for women to own homes and then how to build wealth. So those are my two niches. Oh yeah, I totally agree about that. And you know, I am a new construction girl too. He'll yeah. tell you. <laughs> And my third, I mean, my third question, my third question is, um, so if you see someone sitting on the fence about joining EXP Realty, what would you say to them? I, I come across this a lot because I do a lot of agent attraction. That's kind of my part-time job. And okay. so people who are sitting on the fence, it's usually, I tell them to, it's their risk, their ego. And so the number one thing is like, is this an ego? Thing that you're dealing with, like your brand and all that, or is it um, an actual business decision? And those are the two things that I talk to them about. Um, I always want them to do what's best for them because sometimes it might just not be the right right thing for them. And so I always ask them, tell me more about yourself and get to that problem. Like, what's that pain point? And then once we get to that play point, if that if it makes sense for them, do it. If not, then we don't we don't we can't attract everybody. But we do, you know, like personally, just because we're evangelists for EXP doesn't yeah. mean that it's right yeah. for everybody. But that's those are the two things that I really talk about if you're sitting on the fence. That is yeah. awesome. V, I want to thank you for taking the time to do this interview with me today. It's been awesome. Now, if you are taking a look at ESP, make sure you share this video out. If you're in the market to buy, sell, these two of us, share. We're here to serve. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.